Welcome to a grey and chilly day in Poland. You can see it's getting cold again. We're still in winter, but well, that's just how it is. VO2 max training today. What is VO2 max? It's your peak oxygen uptake. How much oxygen can you take up in your bloodstream to perform at your at your highest? Put in simple words. Personally, I like to do interval trainings. Recent studies also confirmed interval trainings for VO2 max are more beneficial than long aerobic trainings. So therefore, if you have a house at slope, as I do, you can make use of it. You don't ha even have to leave your property. If you don't, all right, find yourself a nice hill, a slope or whatsoever. You can see it here to my side. I'm gonna be warming up, I'm gonna be running up the hill three, four times, easy pace and then gonna push it out 10 times, 100%. Gonna sprint up 100%, walk slowly down, shortly recover for one minute and go again. 10 sprints and you're done. It's okay, so let's get started. Okay, all warmed up now, ready to keep going. Just on a side note, maybe you heard of the book Longevity by Dr. Atia. Longevity in a sense means how to increase your, not lifespan as well, but more your health span to live a longer, comfortable life with your body is still functioning at a high age. And to do so, one of the key indicators also of VO2 max uptake combined with your grip strength, muscle mass, and then you can go into nutrition, sleep, and so on. But VO2 max is also one of the key indicators. The better your cardiovascular system is working, the more chances you will have in the future to live a longer and prosperous life. So now we get real, 100%, 10 sprints, and go back home. Do some other stuff, All right? Okay, not gonna film the remaining five sprints. Short break, keep going. Not done for the day, later on. Got to the boxing classes. Have to cook lunch now, take care of the kids later, and get back home. So yeah, simple one, 10 sprints. You're done twice a week. And you're good to go. All right, guys, see you next time.